Hello everyone, it's good to see some of the younger people here as well, helping us take forward the social justice me message for Australia, which would save Australia from the pits of hell as it is at the moment. I want to remind you of the fact That's the score sheet in terms of children. We have over 30,000 human beings caught in a limbo land where they have no future. The bottom line of this policy of deterrence is that none of the people who came by boat because they came by boat, irrespective of whether they are refugees meeting the convention, will never ever be allowed to settle in Australia under this government. The message is change the government and work on the ALP to find its soul and to find its willingness to comply with the law. It's a dreadful, dreadful tally sheet. There are nearly 5,000 children in our detention system and I'm counting all of those who do not have a future. That's the tally. Forget about the ones behind bars or behind wires or locked up. That's one component of a much larger group of children who have no future. We have 19 at least in the Brisbane Immigration Detention Centre. 19 children and more babies about to be born, both in detention and in the community detention. Seeking asylum is legal. Scott Morrison and his party premise all their arguments and this dreadful legislation on a lie. And their lie is that it is illegal to come by boat to seek protection from persecution. When you found your members of parliament, your senators for Queensland, all 10 of them, remind them that it is the law this is not an opinion of a group like ours. This is the law that it is legal to seek asylum, to be rich or to poor, be poor, to come by boat or by plane. That is absolutely immaterial. I've worked with lawyers for a long time. That is what lawyers, international lawyers say, and that is what the High Court of Australia in the end will say. These petty, piffling politicians are trying to change the law to suit their opinion. It is not law, it is not humane, and it is something we can never ever settle for. Do not settle for this legislation. Keep at Clive Palmer, at Glenn Lazarus, our senators, at your own member of parliament. I've found a three, four officers this morning and had conversations, was listened to, and was thanked for giving my views. The new politicians haven't got a clue. They've got a lot to learn. So our part, numbers do count. All of you, phone a member of parliament. RAC has got the numbers. Do it today, do it tomorrow, do it every week. Do it early, do it often. Thank you very much for coming. It does matter to me that enough people come here to make a demonstration. Thank you so much.